Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to the video. Today I'm bringing guys another Destiny video and before I actually make this commentary, I am using a different mic. I did buy a different mic from Amazon and it just came in yesterday so that's why I really didn't post the video. I was too busy setting up this mic. It was a pain in the ass because it couldn't like fit and everything and then I went to the movie so I really didn't have that much time to post the video. I got back really really late and I, I didn't really want to post the video um, that late so I'm sorry for that. I hope you guys like the quality of the mic. It, this mic was like three times the amount of my other mic so the quality should be a little bit better and uh, I did buy like a better pop filter and stuff like that So I hope you guys enjoy this and uh, stuff like that But anyways getting back to the commentary what I want to talk about today is the best Exotic weapon in destiny as of right now in my opinion now a lot of people might have a different opinion It's open for discussion, but in my opinion this is the best weapon and I'm not talking about year one or year two weapons I'm talking about the TTK weapons obviously so the best weapon the best exotic uh, you can get right now is probably the black spindle now a lot of people might say oh it's the touch of malice or it's this or it's that in my opinion the black spindle is honestly the best sniper rifle the best weapon the best exotic that you can get for any character and the only reason why it's so freaking good for the raid it's so good for the nightfall it's so good for any mission because one obviously it regenerates bullets when you actually hit uh your crip and it reloads by itself so you can just keep shooting uh whatever you're shooting another thing is when you have it maxed out at 310 it does so much to crypt damage, does like 25k plus on anything. It's really, really good. Especially when a witch or a ogre or whatever have a solar shield and you shoot them, two, three bullets and they're dead. And you can honestly, you know, melt them. It's really, really good. Now, if you guys don't know how to get the black spindle sniper rifle, there was actually a, not really a glitch, but there was a video that went out uh, during the daily that you can, you know, go on the other way of the mission and actually get a 310 sniper rifle but then it got nerfed and it really didn't get nerfed and stuff like that but you guys can still get it i'm pretty sure you have to wait till the daily it's i think it's killing tanix or whatever his name is it's that mission you guys can search that up on youtube uh, i was gonna make a tutorial myself but i wasn't recording the first time i actually did it and now there's really no point of me uh doing the you know the mission again to getting uh this sniper rifle because i already have two of them anyways another thing is why i think the sniper rifle is so good is because it's so good for the raid any boss that you're shooting it's really really good for the first boss the second boss oryx whatever uh, you can make so much damage i actually have a clip of us killing the first boss in two tries because all of us had black spindles and all of us had touch of malice and stuff like that and we were just melting him two tries and we actually killed him uh so the black spindle is probably my favorite sniper rifle it is obviously like the black hammer uh, back in year one and if you guys remember the black hammer was just OP Unfortunately, I did not have the black hammer at all. I don't know. I didn't get lucky enough I did not have it everyone that had it was just going nuts about it How good it is and stuff like that before I actually got nerfed But the black spindle probably one of my favorite exotics as of right now Obviously, I like the Suros, but the sniper rifle is just so so OP So let me know what you guys think about this video uh, Let me know your favorite exotic and if you think the black spindle is the best exotic in the game as of right now maybe it's gonna get nerfed in the future maybe it's not you never know maybe destiny will just update it without even us knowing it so thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed this i'm sorry if the video was a little bit too short but it is what it is but thank you guys for watching once again i hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys in the next one peace out